Okay, we're back. We are back in the reactions packet. We are on back of page four. We're going to go through and balance and type these 15 reactions on page four. Okay, first up, I'm going to do the type. We've got one through five. The first five are on the big board. You've got a hydrocarbon, HC. You have oxygen, you have water, and you have carbon dioxide as the products. That can be a combustion reaction. Remember our five types. We've got combustion, singles, doubles, synthesis, and decomp as our five types. So, oh great, I left the second one out. Let's see here. Oh, I got the numbering wrong. So, let's check the numbering. So this is number two. I omitted three. So we will do two, four, and five in this set. I'll have to come back and pick up number three. So to balance this again, you're going to go carbon count. So you have a six on carbon. So you have a six here on carbon you need to make. So you're going to place a six there. You have six on hydrogen, so you have a six you need to place there. So you're going to need a three. Three times two gets you that six. Then you do your O count. And for your O count, you're going to have three times two is uh, three times one is three here. You're going to have six times two is 12 there. So your total is 15. Now, when you have an odd number, which is a 15 is an odd number. You're going to take that odd number, okay, and you're going to place that over 2. So initially you have a fraction there because 15 divided by 2 is 7 and a half. 7 and a half times 2 gets you the needed 15. What we need here is 15. But since we don't like fractions, what I'm going to go ahead and do is multiply everything throughout by 2. So that becomes a 2. That two cancels, that becomes a 15, the three becomes a six, and the six becomes a 12. That is a odd number, that's the twist in the combustion reactions, but we're gonna spend a day on combustion reactions coming up, so we'll do a lot more on those. Uh, the second one, let's see what we got going on here. We've got, looks like we've got cation anion, cation anion, we have a double replacement. So let's see what we got. First up, I'm going to start here because I am even on sulfate. So I need to get even. I'm odd here, but I need to get even. I get even by placing a two in front. That takes care of sulfate. Sulfate is no longer odd. It is even. Okay, let's see what's next. Sodium, I'm going to go with sodium coefficient times subscript, so I have four on sodium, so I need four here on sodium, so I'm going to place a four right there, and that's going to take care of what I need on sodium, and I have four iodides, I can check my iodide, I've got four of those, so I have four on top of this I here, I have four there, I'm good, I have one lead and one lead, that reaction is balanced. So next up, we've got iron height. We've got a single reactant. It can only be a decomp. So that's a decomp. Let's see what we got going on there. Uh, we need, well, right off the bat, I know I need to fix this because I have, I'm sitting on iron. Iron is even here but it is odd here, so I need to put a two, which makes it now even. Okay. So let's see what we got. We got a total of three times two is six oxygens, and I have three times two is six hydrogens. I'm gonna fix the hydrogen next. So I've got six on H, Again, two times three gives me my coefficient times subscript gives me my total number of hydrogens. So what I need here 
is six. Well, two is going to go into six three times, or three times two makes six. And I'm going to see if I'm good on O. I have my six O's. Let's do my O count. I've got three times one. I have three here on O. I have three here on O. I have six O's. Three times two is six. That one is balanced. On to the fifth one. It looks like we've got cation anion, cation anion, which is going to make it a double. Okay, where am I going to start? I'm going to start down here at nitrate. Nitrate here is even, so I need to be even here. So I'm going to put a two there, which does indeed make me even. Okay. So let's see here, what do we want to look at next? Uh, let's look. At hydrogen, we've got two hydrogens here. Change up the color so it's a little easier to track. So we've got two hydrogens here and two hydrogens here. That's going to be four hydrogens total. So I'm going to need a four here. Two goes into four two times. And I'm going to check my O count. see I've got two O's here and two times three I've got six O's there so my total for oxygen is eight so I'm gonna go three times two I've got six here two times one is two there six plus two makes eight and I'm good that's the first four we'll pick it up there for next time